Yes, will you connect me with the East Orange Police Department, please? Yes, there's been an accident. Do you have a coroner available, please? What? No coroner? What? Yes, yes, the physician will be fine. It's 107 North 14th Street. Do come in. I'm Dr. Simmons. I work with the county. And you are? I'm Virginia Wardlaw. They said there'd been an accident? Oh, yes. Just terrible. Um, would you like some tea? She's upstairs. Is she? My niece, O.C. Oceana Sneed. Dear Lord, she's just a child. When did you say you found her? This afternoon. I telephoned the police immediately. She's been dead at least a day. How can you know that? Has she been ill? Oh, yes. Terribly. More so in, in spirit. And you two live here together? Yes. Anyone else? Any, anyone else here? Not that I've encountered. <laughs> Not that I've encountered. What's this? What's what? Suicide note? Where's your telephone? Uh, uh, downstairs on the desk. I've done all I can do. Done all you can do? Well, what else needs to be done? Yes, uh, connect me to the East Orange Police Department, please. Yes, Sergeant O'Neill, please. William, it's Herbert. Yes, we have a body. Uh, a young lady, maybe suicide. I'm gonna need your eyes on this. 107 North 14th Street. Yes, just up from William and Sixth. Yes, I'll be here. Good evening, I'm Sergeant O'Neill. Uh, I'm Virginia Wardlaw. Dr. Simmons. Sorry to call you out so late. Uh, but what's the situation, Doc? Like I told you on the telephone, we have a deceased young lady. Uh, she's been dead since yesterday. Right up this way.
join us. Please. This is how I found the body. Now, I could tell by touch uh, that the body is the same temperature as the room, <clears throat> which is 38 degrees. Don't you people believe in heat? Any assumption on the cause of death, Doc? Nothing, nothing at this point. But with this in mind, we know it was not natural causes nor an accident. Uh, yeah. When did you say you found the girl? This afternoon. And I immediately telephoned the police. The police or the county doctor? Who else lives here? Any visitors? No. No, nobody else lives here or no visitors? No one else lives here, and I haven't seen anyone else since we moved in. How long have you lived here? Hmm? Nine, ten days, maybe? Where did you live before? What does that matter? Where did you live before? Flatlands, in Brooklyn. So you found her this afternoon. She's been dead since yesterday. How is that? I've, I've been out. Oh, out. And how long were you out? I mean, it's obvious this child is in rough condition. D did you not care enough to at least check on her? I put her in a warm bath. She told me she would be all right. Where did you go? What did you do? Damn it, stop! You have no right to accuse me. Nobody is accusing you of anything. Doc, when you're finished up here, would you have the body brought to the morgue, please? You were right to call us in on this one. Nothing makes sense. I'm going to take a look around. This is going to be a long day. A warm bath will do you a world of good. But there's no hot water in the spigot, so you get out and dry off before you get cold, okay? Now, I have to go visit Aunt Mary. So, I'll try to be back tomorrow just as soon as I can. Lucy, Lucy, eat something, okay? There's crackers by the cot. Will you be all right? Don't leave me alone. I don't but, like it here. But I have to. You'll be able to get out on your own, right? I think so. Okay. I love you. I love you, Aunt Jenny. And I'll be back just as soon as I can. Please, hurry. Virginia. Oh, oh, how I oh. missed you. Oh. 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 Come in. Please sit down. I have urgent business in the morning. Could I stay here tonight? Well, of course. You're welcome to this. There's no mattress. Farm animals have better accommodations than we do. <laughs> so, how have you been? How's O.C.? Oh, 
you know, she's recovering slowly. She doesn't eat anything. Where's Caroline? I don't know. I don't really care. She's been a raging nightmare since you snuck off. She doesn't know anything, does she? I haven't let anything slip, but I can't guarantee that Mother didn't say something. What? heard you when you were here before. She asked me if you were in East Orange and if you'd taken OC. I told her I didn't know. Oh my God. But don't worry. Caroline is too rattlebrained to listen to her ramblings. You cannot underestimate our sister. She's been gone since Friday. I'm, I'm sure she just went uptown to see an old teaching friend. I hope you're right. I'm sure that's the case, but... You know, that crazy bitch took all of our tea and the only two cups that we had. you something. Something to make you feel good. Oh my, my poor sick kitten. kitten. We've oh, got to make you better. Look at what you did! Ugh!
Hey! 